my name is Lawrence. I'm a photographer and I've just published a book called If You Leave, which I curated. I remember sitting in the, the diner, which is a place in Shoreditch, and I, I wrote If You Leave Me on a napkin, but I wasn't even, didn't even know what I wrote down. And that's, that napkin is actually the, 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 um, the writing on the book as I scanned it. When I'm looking for pictures, which mo mostly um, is, is online and, and through Flickr, they've all got a very um, heavy sense of m melancholy, and um, and they all have uh, they're all very moody. And it's not about the content as much as uh, the atmosphere. I think the image that was in the book is you know it's very still, it's very sort of desolate. It is, you can there's small figures you can see in it. A lot of the stuff I do is sort of like, it's felt like still, it's got a still feeling to, to imagery. The, the lost nature of stuff, nostalgic and all that, you know, that's what I, I'm into, you know, youthful things. Most pictures um, have a very hazy, unclear, or, or, or a bit blurred, or, or there's it's motion blur, or, or any, any sort of blur. What I like about these is that you can create your own uh, story, it's not all clear, and you have to sort of Leave a lot up to your own imagination. Everyone came from everywhere, and 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 uh, from China uh, to to Siberia to to literally from all over the world. In the book, there's 96 of them. There's so many different uh, nationalities. And more than half of the book are, are are very very young photographers. They're all a lot of them are. are 18 or, or younger, and, and a lot of them are really passionate about their um, about their, their stuff and their work. None of the pictures are lucky shots. I started doing photography basically at um, college in Brockenhurst in the New Forest, and uh, yeah, and then once I got to um, to university, that's where I kind of become a lot more into it. I guess my work grew grew from that really, sort of um, yeah, which went on to the whole American kind of area which I love. And now I live in London and um, sort of finding my way of doing photography, sort of doing a lot of band photos, um, all of that really. It, it sounds really weird but I, I just got quite a lot of love <laughs> out of the whole project. All of a sudden I, I had kind of like 96 new <laughs> new friends or whatever. With the with the internet generation it makes more sense that you, you you get your stuff out there and you can't um, implement your vision on people. People, if they like it, they will pick up on it and that's how it works right now. I just took the book down to a lot of, um, a lot of bookstores in London which I, which I was hoping that they would be interested. So the book is now being sold at the Whitechapel Gallery at Claire de Rouen, which is an amazing bookstore, uh, the Soho bookstores. I've, I've only got two hands and... <laughs> And, uh, and and not that much money and um, and I feel that now I need to kind of hand it over to a bigger publisher in order for it to get more exposure and uh, so yeah if I can if I can find someone who who would um, who would take the project and 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 give it enough <laughs> love and attention and and spread it to the world that would be um, that would be the best thing that could happen to it I, I guess.